You guys don't feel bad for the Giant fans, obviously. I, I don't feel bad. I don't feel bad or good. The Giants, I have no problem with the Giants. We, yeah. took, we took two rings from you guys. Oh, we have six. So, I mean, how many can one team get? I mean, you can only, you can only hold so many in your hands, you right? You only have ten fingers. <laughs> There's no doubt Tom Brady is great. But this is like an asterisk here because, again, I, I hate to keep going back. We're in a pandemic. Brooks Kepka, I think he's a bum. Brooks Kepka is a country club kid. He's mentally weak. I'm going to beat him pretty easily. Let's set the record straight, dude. Some people are saying that you didn't want to hit running backs because you didn't want to get hurt when you played. The last person told me that I slapped him. But I'm going to let you make it. I got um, All For One, the old school R&B band who did that the hit. I swear. I mean, how many babies did you guys are responsible for? Man, I, I, I mean at least half the population of Texas. I swear is bigger than all of any boys and men's song. Hey, he's oh! We saw your Instagram post the other day. Is there any chance to run for office? Maybe. Who knows? Is that like, is that like a dream for you, dude? I know that shaking in the boots anyway. Are you going to go back out and, and, and mingle? Go back out where? And you can go back out and mingle? Where? Everywhere. Aren't you, aren't you single now? Buzz kill! Shaq! How's Christy? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. We got Shaq in New York. He takes the camera and he starts <laughs> dancing with the camera. Dancing with Shaq? Shaq is so graceful. <laughs> I'm dancing with Harvey in New York. I Take love this. TMZ in New York. Yeah, you I, should. I, oh! Hey, <laughs> about Wiener Gang in a fight yesterday. How about that piece of garbage? And Nadia Jones. How about Wiener? How about Wiener? He finally saw the, the. He was like, "Don't judge me." No, we don't. We just judge your penis. You are a fellow Jersey guy. Yeah. Okay. Tell the truth that I spoke at your school when you, you did. were a kid. Yeah, and both of us had a lot more hair. Watch this kids around. Oh. So apparently Jeremy can't ride a bike, so he couldn't put his feet up. You ain't never rode a bike? I never rode a bike, bro. Oh my god. Woo. Jeremy has no shame and is like, I'm going to have a twerk off. Winner takes all. It's going down. Nice. Do it. Hey. <laughs> With the crowd side. With the crowd side. He got her to do it. Good for him. How's my finger wave? Do I do I have do I have enough wrist in it? No, I got a better one. Oh. You don't move your hands. You only move your finger. We don't buy any speech fish. No IKEA. Yeah. No more Spotify until we let him out. Free my man. No more Spotify. Whoa. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Back that. Okay, okay, okay. Not Spotify. But Swedish fish. Cancel Swedish fish. Do you remember what song you lost your virginity to? <laughs> Dude, you guys were awesome last night. No, I didn't lose my virginity to any song because when I hear music, I couldn't even get a heart on. Well, you look like you took uh, a tablecloth and turned it into cargo pants. Couldn't you dress up for this interview? How do you feel about Mr. Met who gave me the middle finger yesterday? Let me tell you something. Yeah. Mr. Met is maligned. Here's a guy, he has a baseball for a head. Yeah. <laughs> and yet he chooses to go to work in a place that is filled with baseball bats, his natural enemy. I really respect the work you're doing, and I, I know it's hard and it's cold, but you know, there. if there's two things I could give less of a fuck about, it's like ice hockey and... Uh, it's know. bigger than that, it's about unity, it's about North and South Korea uniting, uh, Anthony. It bothered me that in saying we regretted upsetting hundreds of millions of Chinese fans while at the same time supporting Daryl Morey's speech. It, 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 it bothered me, I'd say, that that was interpreted as an apology to the Chinese government. Have you ever considered helping guard people who need artificial insemination? I'm saying like, like there's a lot of couples who are trying. Dude, I mean, listen, you're incredibly you're handsome, you're incredibly, you're, you're incredibly, you're incredibly, and most more, you're incredibly potent. You're so potent. <laughs> what up, Uzi? You still got that diamond, brother? Yes. I had a show at Rolling Loud, and I jumped in the crowd, and they kind of, Ripped it out. Do you think we should get rid of fighting in hockey at some point? Oh, uh, it's not in there very much anymore. It's kind of, it's kind of out of hockey now. So it's gonna happen every now and then. But you guys hungry? Want hot dog? Shit, Sorry, hot dogs. <laughs> yeah, of course. Yeah. Congratulations, number one hit. Woo! Nice celebrating. I mean, really, could they have New Year's Eve in New York without Andy Cohen? <laughs> yes, they could. They could, dude. Yeah, they definitely you, could. Dude, you have more power than them. You have more yeah. power than them. No, I don't. I would hate to be tickled at that. And Thomas Lennon just just stares at him for a couple seconds. You're new, right? Have I ever kicked you in the nuts yet? <laughs>